We had a lot of creeps, though, in our area. And I was 10 years old, and I'll never forget this day. I was standing outside of a hockey rink. My brother's inside playing hockey. My dad's watching the game. And I was just hanging out in the parking lot, playing with glass and nails and stuff, like you were allowed to do in 92. And this old dude pulled up in an old car. I'll never forget his face. Not a panel van, like a Buick Riviera. And he pulls up, and he's like, hey, kid, your dad told me to give you a ride home. I was like, that's weird. He's inside, I think he would have mentioned this. He goes, no, I'm his good friend. I gotta bring you home right away. I was like, mm-mm. He goes, I got candy. And I'm 10, so I was like, what kind of candy you got? He goes, I got candy corn. <laughs> what? <laughs> I'm gonna let you me for no candy <laughs> If you like it, you should have put a rain pop on it, you know what I'm saying? <laughs> that is a true story. The only reason I'm not dead is because he had shitty candy. <laughs> if he said Twix, I would have been like, do I get right and left Twix? Slide over, cowboy. Let's see where this horse is going. <laughs> Peanut brittle? What? What am I, a pilgrim? Cat, dead in a river. You know what I mean? <laughs> Break me off a piece. <laughs> you know that guy just sped to like the nearest store, like Arbor Drugs or some shit. Like, what do kids like? Circus peanuts? They're like, what the fuck? <laughs> Get a new hobby. <laughs>